Real Agriculture's coverage of Agritechnica 2017 is brought to you by Dow AgroSciences Canada. Kelvin Hepner with Real Agriculture. We're at Agritechnica 2017. Our coverage brought to you by Dow AgroSciences. And uh, joining us now, we have Alexandra from Fritzmeier Cabs. And Alexandra, this cab behind us, uh, obviously a lot of glass. And you're working on the smart cab or, or the cab concept, how to design really the best cab possible for farmers? <laughs> I hope so. I hope this was the best cab ever. Well, the thing is, we are a cab concept cluster. This was founded in 2014 as a corporation out of OEM suppliers, just to show our OEMs what is the best benefit of doing projects together and showing the best system integration. So there are, is it 13 companies involved? Um, exactly, 13 companies. Um, we have uh, cluster partners um, from suppliers like a HVAC supplier, we as a cab supplier, we have, for example, Helle as a light supplier, and we have even partners from the Praxis, and they supported us during the complete development process that we do really that what is needed for the end customer. Okay. So what are the things that you focus on and from a farmer's perspective? Visibility, maybe not too many screens, filling up exactly. the window. Uh, what are some yeah. of the things that you focus on? Well, we have basically um, three main core topics. This, this is what you can see on our booth. The first thing is serial tested modularity. This cabin, what you see here, is called the Smart Cab, and we really like to sell this cabin. Fritz Meyer produced this cab already in serial, and it's free, available on the market. Um, this means serial tested. And then we have modularity, so there are different functions and innovations you can integrate and which you can put flexible together. Okay. The next big topic is X to X usability. You might have seen maybe the drone up uh, on our cabin. So the machine needs to talk to the driver, the cab talks to the machine, the machine to the drone. And that was the reason why we called it X to X usability, in the case that we would like to make the cabin for the future safe. It might happen that you need in the future different functions or innovations, and with our CAN system and our body control unit, you can integrate flexible a lot of new functions afterwards. Okay. So it's kind of the idea of, of you make this platform and add the options, make the options uh, an, op an option, or essentially the, exactly. an, something that you can add later. Yes. And the next, the third big topic is smart farming. This is, uh, everybody's talking about precision farming, smart farming, and we talked, we named it smart farming readiness. So we'd say, we are not doing smart farming products, but we are ready for it. We can, we understand it and we can implement it. And one example is from Bosch. This is one of our cluster partner. They have developed a feature store. This is like a cloud and there's a connectivity unit integrated, which takes the data from the back end. And then the farmer, wherever he is in the world, can drive his machine and collect all the data, the environmental weather forecasts, the, the, the ground information, and takes the data, upload it into the feature store, and then another farmer who has the same conditions can take it against some money or whatever provision and use it as well. So it's all about how can I use my data profitable and how can I share my information. Okay. And the fourth, the fourth idea? This is basically these are our three main core topics, but I can let you know some more innovation we have integrated. Uh, a really nice innovation from Bosch is the camera system over here. We have four of them on the left and right side, in the fore side and the back side. And this is called the surrounding easy fit system and is connected with the ultrasonic sensors here. And this is regarding safety and, safety and warning. And on the HMI, when you sit in the cabin, you see an, a warning sign and the top view 360, like you know it from automotive. Okay. So what are some of the, the technologies that you maybe haven't included, but are options or, or something that you see in the future in terms of cab technology and, and making things easier and more comfortable for the operator? Well, um, one of my favorite innovations is the Mega Lung system, the Vision 4.0 system. This is a, there are cameras included on the left and the right side, and they are connected to these um, displays inside, which are connected to our CAN system, and they have a very great um, visibility at day and at night. And we think that this could be a great benefit for the driver. Okay. So we see driverless tractors here. People won't want driverless tractors with a cab like this. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> what about in the in the future? Uh, I believe there's at least one tractor company here that has their screens in the glass or a display in the glass. Is that something yeah. that, that works? Well, we have as, as well here in um, Anser, um, we have integrated so-called electroluminescence displays, ELEDs. And this is basically glass, two layers of glass. And you can um, show flexible warning signals or temperature. And this is 
And they, this um, company called Binek, and they working as well to integrate this kind of um, displays into the front screen. So this, um, I think this is something we can see in the future and it would be a great innovation. All right. Well, thanks for your time and we'll look forward to what cabs look like in the future, Alex. Thank you. Thank you very much.